So guys, welcome back to the uh, Wild Badge Check channel. This is going to be one of my uh, badges budget buys for camping. I found this on Timu. Um, this was just a purchase of mine. It wasn't a serious purchase. It was actually, I thought it'd be quite funny to order, to see what, what came. I was expecting a dollhouse washing machine to come through. Wasn't expecting what, uh, what actually received through the door from Timu. So this is a portable washing machine and it's gonna be beneficial for my camping trips and probably for yours as well, who's watching this. So we'll get to it, we'll um, open it up. You guys can have a look at it and uh, we'll get it working. Let's um, see it in action. Let's see if it actually does wash um, materials. Uh, we'll, we'll even get the material dirty. So as I said, I bought this off Timu. I think it was £3.49. If I'm wrong, I'll um, pull it here now. But to be fair, the material for £3, I didn't expect it to be this good, to be fair, the material. It does feel quite strong and robust. It does have some sticky pads underneath, that's what you can hear. Um, and I'm guessing that's when it starts to move. Uh, this will work. Uh, keep it in situ. So here what I'm going to do is some hot watering. Obviously it can't um, make its own hot water, can't heat it up. So I'm going to put some hot water in to help with the, uh, the wash. And I'm just going to fill it up just prior or just in line with that dark green as it meets the, uh, the lighter green. Uh, cause obviously when it's washing, it will minute, uh, the water will swish around. Happy with that. Um, obviously, water and electric don't go together, so just be mindful of that if you're going to splash it around like myself. Give it a quick dry. Now, as you can see here, there's the power lead, well, the power that DC, um, so I'm just gonna plug that in. As you heard, there's a beep. That's just to let you know it's on. Uh, what I'm going, going to do is I'm going to use this fresh tea towel and we're going to spill some coffee. So we'll sort of spill some coffee on here like this. Glad my wife and I. I'll clean it up after. As you can see, there's the coffee. Going to bring you in closer so you can see what actually happens before that though i am going to set the machine off and i'm just going to pull the tab in just to get the uh, the tab mounted uh, inside it is lukewarm so we'll just put that in first and we'll get that mounted and we'll put it in after Okay, so you've got the 10 minute standard washing setting, you have a 15 minute soft washing setting, and you have a two minute semi dehydration setting, that's with a basket, which I will show you a bit later on in the video. But how you uh, get through these um, settings, I'll just hold in the switch button, and that set that for the 10 minute standard wash, and then it will cut out after 10 minutes. And now what I'm going to do is just going to put this dirty tea towel into the wash by just sticking it in and putting it on that 10 minute wash. Whilst that's washing then, 
I'm just going to put a few of these um, smelly balls in just to make it smell nice. And we'll just drop them inside. As you can see, the water has changed its colour. It's gone to the coffee colour now. Which I'd probably suggest that is um, taking the dirt out of the water. Sorry, taking the uh, the dirt out of the tea towel. Um, I've got some hopes for that now, but this is going to work. As you can see, it is spinning, and it's not moving because it's got them suction uh, pads underneath. If this works, this is a fantastic purchase from Timu. It only works if you pay three pound. If you're going to pay the three pound four pence, you have to be a new member with Timu. So what I would suggest if you're already with Timu is create another account under a different email and mobile number um, to get that um, discount for this washing machine. Otherwise you're paying I think up to 30 something pound for a washing machine. Try and put a few in your basket and see if it allows you to purchase a few of them under the £3.04 pence price. Um, you know. For something like this for camping, families, for family camping, you know, your kids are running around in the mud, they're getting dirty. It's easy to spring this up, pull a bit of water in, and if you're on an electric point, um, if you've got an electric point on your campsite, you know, this is perfect. So it's come to its end of the cycle now. Uh, the water is, is dirty, it's pitch, well, it looks like a puddle of mud itself. It does smell clean. Obviously, that's we put down to the um, products. What we'll do first, though, obviously, because it's being water with electrics, we will just um, disconnect it and we'll take it over by the sink so we can now drain it. So there is a little toggle here you pull out and that's what drains the, um, the washing machine. What I will do is just rinse this out. But as you can see from the tea towel, it's taken out the, um, it's taken the coffee out of it. Let that finish off draining. What I would do as well is when you've drained it, I would leave the little toggle out um, to let this get air through to dry it out. You don't want to stick that in whilst there's water inside for it to go stagnant um, and then affect how this machine actually works. So let's take it back over there. Let's get the, uh, the dehydration basket. Let's stick it in that and let's see what happens. Okay, so I'll be back. Uh, we're going to use the dehydration basket now uh, and what happens is we, as you push it inside it's got the grooves of where the motor sits and you just basically push it in and it, you will hear it click. Okay what we'll just do now we're just going to put in the tea towel into the dehydration basket um, and then let's get this on a spin. So again we're just going to plug in our DC adapter there you go, you hear it's, it's on. Just spin it round. Just make sure it's... Just make sure that's uh, stuck to there. To go on to the dehydration, which again, holding the switch button. And, and again. And again. Okay, and now it's come to a stop. We'll just take it out to see. No, it doesn't feel any different. So I don't know what purpose the dehydration basket has. Now to get the dehydration basket out of this portable washing machine, I have seen a few people comment on Timu on reviews um, asking how to do it because they're getting stuck with it. They're ripping it out and breaking the motor. The best way I found to do it is basically 
get your finger behind the basket, so behind the basket down here, and just give it a little nudge, and the basket will come off. If you're trying to pull it from here, it doesn't work. So when I click it back in, just try and put it from here, you're really going to break the motor. You need to get your hand around the back, underneath, and just push your fingers between the bottom of the motor and the basket, and it will uh, come off. Now my overall view of this, you know, this cost me three pound four pence, and I bought it as an experiment. Really, I bought it thinking what you know what was going to turn up for me. I generally thought it would have been some sort of dollhouse little toy. But if you're looking at uh, camping, uh, you, you know, if you're looking online, these type of uh, machines, are, you know, you're looking at fifty to hundreds of pounds. I weren't expecting miracles with this machine, but I'm really impressed. I'm impressed at the fact that the material of it and for it to be dispatched to me, packed, all for three pound, four pence, you know, I can't grumble with it. What I would suggest you do though, is if you, as I said to you before, if you are a Timu um, customer, is create another account uh, under a different email address, different mobile number, uh, and purchase this under the three pound four pence because if you're already a Timu uh, customer, you're looking at thirty pound plus to buy this machine. If you subscribe to my channel, click the notification bell to be notified when I upload my videos, and click the like button. It would be appreciated. You would then get notified of any other um, videos I upload. I am going to order some more stuff from Timu. I'm going to create a video of a budget camp. So if you're interested in camping, look out for that video. I will be putting up the video in regards to the Timu hammock, uh, cooking system, etc. for that video under a certain amount of budget for those who want to start hammock camping or camping uh, and want to get into it but don't want to spend a lot of money, uh, maybe if they don't, because they may not like it. Uh, so look out for that video. As I say, thanks again for coming and tuning in to the Wild Badger Trek channel. Um, look out for the other videos. I will see you then.